All right, last week we ended wet. We'll meet you at the Öresundsbron, the bridge over to Denmark. But we didn't really make it as far as we planned because it came a snowstorm. It caught up to us. Uh, so we were stuck in traffic for like two hours where we completely stood still. So as soon as we got out of that, we just pulled off. Oh, it's so windy. <laughs> so we just pulled off to stand at the nearest place we could find and it was like an hour and 40 away from the bridge, I think. It's been not snowing too much, but the wind has been insane. So we were a bit sneaky and parked next to a massive caravan. So we got a bit of shelter from the wind because it was like the whole van was shaking. It was awful. I think it said it was 19 meters per second um, in the like highest. So it's been not a very nice evening. <laughs> And now I'm out because I need to shovel the van out a little bit because even if it's not been too much snow, all the wind has blown like up against the van. So uh, take a look at this. Like the snow is covering the bushes and the bushes is probably over a meter high. It's insane. All right, back on the road. Yeah, back we on the road. We are like an hour and a half away from the bridge, so yeah. um, not as we hoped, but... We're only an hour. We're an hour further away than we hoped to have been. Yeah, we're on our way, we're not on a time rush. We were hoping to get the ferry to Hull on Saturday night, but I don't know if we're gonna manage to do that, because I've also heard it's supposed to be chaotic in Denmark yeah. <laughs> and then nothing works because of this storm. No. So um, we'll just take it one day at a time, maybe even one hour at a time and see where we end up. Yeah. Um, just well, drive safe and make sure it's not us who's in the accident yeah, exactly. <laughs> anywhere. So We were planning on obviously getting the ferry over to Germany today Yeah. to drive all the way through Denmark and over to Germany today. Yeah. And I think if we don't do that, then we're going to struggle to get all the way over to Rotterdam to get the ferry for Saturday. Yeah. And but the problem is, there's no ferries between Saturday and like Tuesday, I think. Yeah. So. There is other ferries, just that we don't end up as close to your family. Like That's we have it. to drive a lot longer in England. Yeah, exactly. But like you said, we'll just see what happens. We'll see what happens. It's not. Yeah, uh, we uh, like we could do it. We could smash through it, but we got kids who's not got... super happy to be driving all the time. So exactly. we'll see where we end up. Yeah. More traffic. We sat for an hour and a half yesterday. Yeah, last probably night. two to be honest. Was it? Yeah. Two, hour, two hours, was it? A, a complete standstill on the motorway. Yeah, it was a lady in the shop who told me that uh, it had been on the news this morning that people have been stood in cars for 14 hours. 14 hours? Yeah. Imagine, oh my god, that's so bad. Imagine being sat for 14 hours. Yeah, like for us, it's no problem. We got bed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I mean, like a normal car, you're so cold oh and no food and no yeah. nothing. Oh, awful. Nothing worse. All right, we're crossing the bridge. Now we're crossing the bridge. So bye bye Sweden bye for bye Sweden. four months. Oh, I hope so. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Feels good to say that, doesn't it? Yeah. Is that it? See you uh, in the summer, Sweden. Yeah. That feels weird. Yeah, that does feel weird. Exciting. Yeah. All right, we made it to Rødby, uh, the bottom of Denmark. Uh, so we've drove through Denmark in one go, pretty much. Um, we've not really stopped since getting off the bridge. We've arrived extremely stressed, even though we've had a nice, lovely day, because uh, we've just driven through an actual flood. Oh my God, that was absolutely terrifying. The motorway has been closed off in loads of different places on the way. Uh, they've obviously had really bad problems with floods and uh, one of them wasn't closed, the one that we ended up on near the ferry terminal. And we've driven through and it's honestly, it's like above the engine bay sort of thing. So I've driven, I've had my foot down all the way through it, but it's like a, a long stretch. So we're stressed as hell and terrified that something's, that it's done some real damage to the van especially because the diesel heater, there's sort of parts that naturally stick out underneath. 
which are not really designed to be uh, driven through heavy water like that. So, <sighs> so we've sat in traffic as well on the way down. So we're a bit later than uh, expected. But once we get on the ferry, we'll be nice and calm, and uh, we'll uh, we'll be in Germany in uh, an hour or two, which feels nice. This is a first. Look at this. Sat in the passenger seat. <laughs> first ever time driving the big van. I'm definitely more nervous than she is. <laughs> but uh, no, I've got 100% faith in you. You're going to absolutely smash it. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. If I smash it. <laughs> Don't even joke, mate. Don't even joke. We live in this. <laughs> <laughs> not just driving a van now you're driving a home <laughs> so uh yeah first time ever driving uh, in a foreign country as well we're in germany obviously now we uh made it over on the ferry in the end last night after a bit of a disaster um of a drive in the rest of denmark but yeah the plan for today is we've made a bit of a hasty decision right <laughs> and uh i'm hoping it pays off the ferry that goes from Rotterdam to Hull is the one that we really want if we can because uh, Hull is very close to our destination when we get to England. When I, uh, when I looked at the ferry uh, last night to go on to book it, that ferry for Saturday, the Rotterdam to Hull ferry, uh, was sold out and uh, uh, we were gutted. But then uh, when we had another little look this morning, there'd obviously been a cancellation or they'd added new spaces or whatever and it was on again and available to book. So today is Friday, about one in the afternoon, and the ferry is booked for Saturday, tomorrow night, at uh, 8.30 in Rotterdam. And we are currently just outside of Puttgarden in Germany. So it says we've got about seven and a half hours-ish uh, to get over there. If it was just me and Molly, then that'd be fine. You could do seven hours in one day if it's just two adults, no problem. But um, we're not just two adults. We're, the, we're these little picky buggers in the back, can't we? Yeah, but um, I've got full faith. We're going into this with uh, absolute confidence. So um, we'll see, we'll see where we end up. Charlie's super excited to go on the big boat where you get to sleep on it. Uh, yeah. And with, like, I think that's fine because when you got something like a goal, then he's a lot easier to get um, entertained in the car and stuff. Absolutely, you can use that as motivation, can't you? And uh, Bella, we just bribe with racing, so she's happy. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. We'll see. Hopefully, by uh, by the end of tomorrow, we'll be in uh, Rotterdam, and by lunchtime the day after, we'll be in England. Exciting. All right. So we are about an hour and a half away from uh, the ferry. Later, we've made really, really good progress today. We left uh, just under three hours, I think. Of, uh, of drive time from where we were in uh, in Germany, like on the border of Germany and Holland. And we've made really good time. So we've got about an hour and a half left, I think. Um, so we stopped off for some lunch, having a little run around, burning off a bit of energy. It feels weird that we're gonna be getting on the ferry tonight. It's exciting. And then this time tomorrow, we'll have uh, reached our destination. We'll wake up in England tomorrow, and then we've got a couple of hours of, uh, of driving from Hull to, uh, to Nottinghamshire. Feels like we've made really good progress this time. Yeah, they've apparently had uh, really bad floods here and in Germany from where we were. So we've driven past loads of these sort of huge like bodies of water that I don't think are actually really supposed to be this big. We've seen like entire farmers fields and stuff um, just completely, completely waterlogged. So it's, uh, it's mental. So we've obviously had the bad weather coming from the north with the snow and stuff. And these have had storms and, uh, and really, really, really heavy rain. So. What's that, mate? The bridge over there. The bridge. That's where we've just driven, isn't it? Yeah. No, what I see. What do you see? One more horse. One more horse over there. Follow after me. Follow after you. Go, Charlie. Go. Everybody run. Everybody run. Everybody run. Charlie says run. Everybody run. <laughs> Luxury lunch. Very hot 
Oh, very so I need this four one. minute noodles. Mama. <laughs> You can sit there, and then we're going to go like this. I come to mm -hmm. sit on the other one. You sit on the other one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to do things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The thingies mm -hmm. on the side. Yeah. Fancy coconut bowls. Mm. Make an appearance. <laughs> Again? Again. <laughs> hey, look how nice and finished off that looks now, above you. Yeah, it looks lovely, don't it? It's great. Yeah. Didn't have time to paint this though, but the doors do now. That. Do that in the spring. Yeah. I think it looks alright like that anyway. Yeah. I think like a soft pink or something yeah. would look nice on that. Yeah. We made it to the ferry! Woo! Here we are! Yeah, um, ferry! Yay! Yeah. And we've only got five hours to wait until it departs. But, Woo! <laughs> but, there's one thing to do. What's it left to do? To go on the ferry. To go on the ferry. What are we going to do on the ferry? Sleep? We're going to sleep on there. It's exciting, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be loads of fun. Yeah, you're super excited. Are you there rolling your eyes? Is it boring? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you monkey. She's been asleep for an hour and a half, so I mean, she got all the energy in the world. Yeah. <laughs> to be thought. <laughs> she loves to watch herself, I don't she? Hmm. hmm. Who is that little monkey? Hmm. <laughs> so um, we've heard that check-in starts like now-ish, and then we've got about an hour and a half to wait until we can actually get on. Yeah. Neither of us know really how this works. We've taken small ferries and uh, even like this, the overnight ones that we've taken to like, like Finland and stuff, a lot smaller yeah. in scale than this. Yeah, yeah. So uh, it's quite a new adventure for all of us, I think, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's going to be interesting to see how it, it works. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be fun. These kids are so excited. Charlie can't wait to sleep on the ferry. Yeah, I bet there's going to be no sleeping going on. No, minimal sleeping at least. It feels nice that when we get off, Obviously, tomorrow morning when we wake up, we're in England, pretty much. And then uh, when we get off, we've got uh, like an hour and a half of actual driving to do until we get to Nottinghamshire, which is yeah. nice. Feels nicer we're than the be... four plus hours it was last time. Yeah. We're going to be there for lunchtime, which feels nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah even if we gonna... stop off to do a bit of shopping, it'll still be early afternoon, won't it? So. Yeah. It's exciting, Charlie. Are you driving? Are you driving? Are you driving, Sunny? I help you. You're helping me, yeah. Yeah, you're a good driver, you are. Okay. Look at that little dude. Charlie. He's little Charlie. Yeah. Charlie. Bella, what's your what does it say on here? What's your full name? Isabella. Maeve. Isabella Maeve. Papa. Cute, aren't you? Isabella Harrop. Yeah, that's your name, isn't it? Isabella Harrop. Okay, is everybody sat down and ready? I'm ready. I'm Look ready. at it. Look at how big it is, Charlie. Yeah. Look at the size what? of that boat. Oh, the for so of my I think we've got two very, very, very excited kids. Yeah, yeah. we're not going to get any sleep at all tonight, are we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's going to be fun though. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Three, two, one, jump. Next. Three, Three two, two, one, one. jump. Right. Let's do this. Bye, Sonny. It feels Bye, Sonny. so weird to leave her now when it's our home. It does, it does. Just if you're right at all. I know, it's so it. Anxious leaving her. Yeah, it feels Mama, weird. She'll be all right though, she'll be nice and warm, eh? Won't you, mate? Defrost a bit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's still got ice in the back from Sweden. Yeah. Like five days ago. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> it only got plus degrees uh, like last, last night. night. Yeah. yeah. Are you coming, mate? Attention. How's it going? Tell me she doesn't look like the little, is it a bunny in uh, Robin Hood? Yeah. The one that always carries her doll with her, <laughs> like running. <laughs> she looks like identical. She does, honestly. <laughs> Yeah. We're on the boat. We're going to be poor, poor, then. Bella, you can see it. I still do. 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 I
Yeah. See what happens if we do this, look. Yeah. Let's see. Divide. Yes. Yeah. Come on in. Just jumped all right off. Oh, we can see outside. Look as well. We've got a window. Yeah. Ooh. Are you going to shoot already? <laughs> no, I just pulled. Yeah, I'm just pulled right in. You're going to pull right there. You're going to suck that. Is it the most exciting? <laughs> it was cosy, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah, good. Are we ready to start the day? Woo! We, are we <laughs> Still uh, got very excited kids yeah. this morning. Yeah. <laughs> Loving it. <laughs> Surprised how well it's left actually. Yeah, it's left, uh, I think everybody slept quite well. Yeah, and I was shocked when it was like 20 past 6 when we woke up because yeah. I thought like we could, might as well have woken up at 4 and been yeah. super excited. But do you know where we can go today? Where can we go today? To the Farmer Farfars. The Farmer Farfars, yeah, it's exciting, isn't it? Yeah. Nice, we just gotta wait for these trucks to move in front of us. Yeah. And then we can get going, can't we? Yeah. Exciting. Oh yeah, I'm driving on the left. <laughs> I'm driving on the left. I need to do my kilometres an hour to miles per hour chart again you as well. Mama. You Unprepared do. this time. Yeah. I'm gonna go and do some shopping first on the way. <coughs> Christmas presents. <laughs> buy Christmas, can't buy Christmas presents on January 7th. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, mate. Yeah, I think this is the better way to do it. Like I thought the tunnel, uh, you call it the tunnel? Yeah, the between France and, yeah, yeah. Do Dover to Calais, yeah, the tunnel, yeah. I thought that that was enjoyable for me, and the kids thought it was super exciting, but you do stay in your van the whole time, which for them makes it feel like you're just traveling the whole time. Yeah, it like, doesn't really like break it up, does it, in the no. same way, even though it's exciting, it's not like, like You don't now. get out and run or whatever, like here, they had like play areas where the kids were like playing for an hour, two hours last night yeah. and an hour this morning. And that for them feels like, all right, we left the van, we've done something fun, something exciting yeah. and now we're traveling again. Definitely. Uh, the other one was just traveling for them, even if it was exciting. All right, about 30 minutes left now then. Half an hour left. Ooh. Tastes like it's gone so fast this time. Yeah. I mean, last time when we were leaving, to, like when we were heading towards my mum's, it was like four hours, wasn't it? Yeah. From the start. And now it's been like an hour and a half and we've done shopping on the way. Yeah. So it's such a much better way of doing it. And then it's the, uh, the first uh, stop, the first destination. Yeah. Five more, five first, first, Nan and Grandad in the week. Yeah. Maybe at the Lucy today as well. We'll yeah, see. Yeah. See, we've got a lot of uh, family to check off the list yeah. and a lot of friends as well, so yeah. it'll be good. And then I think we'll probably be here for a couple of weeks, right? Yeah, something like that. Two yeah. weeks and then uh, somewhere warmer. But we've already gained like 18 degrees. <laughs> well, more, it was minus 19 at home Minus 19 yesterday. and now it's plus four, so we've gained 25 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> That's a win in my book. Yeah. Let's add another like... 20. Yeah, add another 20 on there in a few weeks time and uh, I think we'll be happy. Yeah. <laughs> How many minutes is it now, Charlie? One minute? Is that all? Yeah. That's still one minute. So here we are, finally our first destination of our travels. It feels great to finally be here and out of the disgustingly cold Scandinavian weather and into the uh, sunny climate of England in January. Thanks very much for tagging along with us on this one. It's been a really fun journey. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, we'll catch you next Friday. Bye.